Hi and welcome to another episode of Ribbit Plays Devil May Cry. Today we're playing Mission 9, uh, Devil Inside. This is the mission where you unlock the Devil Trigger when you're on your first playthrough. Blinded and imprisoned here for how long? Hundreds of years. Are you sure you know your way around? Like the back of my hand. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Are you nuts? I forget. You and I see things differently. Seeing things differently can open new paths. What do you mean? You only see evil in me because I am a demon. Try opening your mind. It's all a matter of perspective. As I said, I see things differently. We'll meet up ahead. I have something to show you. So, Dante getting some. Words of wisdom from the demon to not judge every book by its cover, I guess. So let's press forward and see what the demon wants to show us. Her name was Asiel, an ancient one, Nephilim, like you. I didn't know there were others. The Nephilim were the third race. Sadly, they were hunted down and slain. Why? They wielded the power of both angels and demons. But unlike them, the Nephilim could easily cross worlds. They were formidable. Which made them a threat. Like me. And like you, they held great potential. What a waste. You want to reach your full potential? Perhaps... Asio holds the key. So... Well... Educated demon? Well, he did say he was a scholar, so I assume... He probably is. So let's get down here... To the... Statue. Yep. Nope, it's a fucking deep. Let's finish off these guys pretty quickly and progress forward to unlock. Good right, Asiel holds the key. Whatever it is that key wants to unlock.
All right. So Let's see what happens. We're back in this subconscious or dreamlike world. To break another chain. You are here because I wasn't able to protect you. For that, I am truly sorry. Your father fell in love with me. A love that transgressed rigid, ancient boundaries. We chose our path in the face of certain annihilation. We never regretted our choices, but we never gave you yours, my dear son. Now, finally, you will have that choice. You will have a great power. A power that will allow you to forge your own path. That, my son, is freedom. Be brave, my son. I love you. So, a heart touching message from Eva, Dante's mother, and one of these demons. Let's take care of you, shall we? Oh. Well. That's not very smart, no, is it? So, shoot some blades at me, please. So that's when you unlock Devil Trigger normally. And it, the first time you get it, it, it forces you to use it in that first fight there. Although on the lower difficulties, it's, it's not one of those demons. Um, Rages, which I so do enjoy to fight, not at all really, although it's nice to get the little challenge once in a while. So 
so up into there. But of course I can't use the regular weapons on it because it's a demon rage. And the demon rages can only be hurt by demon weapons. Um take care of the witch. Because like the harpies I tend to get hit by her attacks if I don't focus her down. I had to use Devil Trigger, or rather, I didn't have to, but I wanted to recover some health and uh, get uh, my <laughs> and take care of those enemies without getting hit. Although I could probably have done it without the Devil Trigger, but uh, since it regains health as well, I might as well use it. So. This area is pretty nasty. Uh, I saw there was head for there. Yeah, let's get there first. Whoa! Uh, that's health too. So let's see, let's drag something over here, hopefully, and take care of some enemies before I get swarmed and brutally murdered. Harpist. Uh, another heart to there. Take care of you. Oh. And a witch. Fantastic. That's better though, since if you're protecting the harpy, you can't protect yourself. Uh oh. That didn't work out as planned. Because I lost track of what weapon I had equipped. So I tried to parry the the witch with the, the wrong weapon. I should probably bind the shoot key to one of the dodge buttons so I could charge them. Charge shots while comboing, like uh, I do with Nero in Devil May Cry 4, since he relies on his charge shots quite a great deal. Although Ebony and Ivory are pretty weak in this version. So, some platforming. That was wild. Come here. What is it? 
You found your inner devil, all right. But you have yet to discover your full potential. Mainly, I just want to kill the demon king named Mundus. And if you do kill Mundus, who would take his place? So, something to think about. For Dante there. This was a pretty short mission. Like the last one. So I just end this episode here. The next mission is... Uh, the boss fight, if I remember correctly. So, look forward to that. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.